Lord, hello, 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 y'all. I'm sorry that you're in the blinding light. I'm sitting at a school zone and I am waiting. Whoa. Can you see me? I come in peace. Honey, it's 8 a.m. Actually, it's 7.45 a.m. on a Wednesday. And I am... <sighs> I'm not nervous. I'm just anxious. I'm going to... I had my temporary crown put on last... About, I don't know, two weeks ago. And so the permanent crown is here. And I'm going to get the permanent crown on. I'm so sorry about that light. It should be clearing up in a little bit. Anywho, I hate dental stuff. I hate dental work. It's my own fault. So I'm the type of person where I'm going to accept responsibility. I had not been to the dentist in an embarrassingly long time because I absolutely hate it. I know that's no excuse, but I'm just telling you. Let me just do this for now. I'm also worried this lady's looking at me. Honey, I'm just doing a vlog here. Um, I'm also in my new American Eagle fuzzy jacket and I'm trying to decide if I like it because it's a medium tall and it's fitting snug and it's, I still feel like the sleeves are not long enough for my liking. Anyway, that was a tangent because I just saw it in the corner of my eye. I have not been to the dentist in an embarrassingly long amount of time. So when I had gone to the dentist, um, Jenny Irvin, who you all know that I run with, let's see if I can, I don't know what to do to make this any better at the moment. So I'm sorry that you're blinded by the light. I went for my cleaning and it had literally been probably, gosh, I don't know. I'm trying to uh, make sure that I get on the correct road with my navigation on my watch. So I went and I had a couple small cavities and it had literally all been like, I mean, this is, like I said, this is embarrassing. It had been like five or six years probably since I had gone to the dentist. And I wasn't having any problems. I just knew that I know needed to go get it cleaned. Anyway, they ended up finding where I needed to get a crown. And it was very, very close to the nerve. So they did a temporary crown. And um, I wasn't in very much pain that day. There we go. The sun's doing better now. I wasn't in a lot of pain that day. It was obviously awkward and I hated it because they have to give you a shot in the roof of your mouth to numb you. It was a terrible experience. The dentist was great. The actual dentist itself was great. The experience was just not great. I just don't know anybody that would like that experience. I'm sorry. I just, it makes me crazy. Anyway, it has now been over two weeks and I still have to keep ibuprofen in me almost at all times to not be in pain. And so... I personally think something is wrong with it. I'm going to talk to them today before they put the permanent on. But, uh, and I thought, Lord, I'm so anxious and nervous. I just need to go and talk to my people on YouTube because y'all make me feel better. You're just a comforting presence to me when I'm vlogging. And I just thought I would come in here, come on here and say hello. So my plan is to get my permanent in theory. What is happening right here? Oh. There was somebody in the yard and I thought they were dead. They're not dead. I don't know what they're doing, but they're not dead. He's checking something. Oh, maybe he's checking for like a septic tank. Anyway, this video is called ADD Rambling. And I don't know, we'll see. We'll see what happens. My prediction is that I needed slash need to get a root canal because I don't want them, my fear is they're gonna put the permanent on and I'm still gonna have pain and then I'm gonna have to end up coming and have the permanent taken off and get a root canal. So if that's the case, I would rather just have the root canal today. Like, just do it, please. I hate tooth stuff, y'all, I hate it. It makes me so anxious. So now I know how Tracy B feels. Tracy B has had extensive dental work done and she always vlogs on her way to the dentist. And I was like, I'm just gonna vlog. I'm just gonna vlog and it's gonna make me feel better. So I'm supposed to be teaching my classes today. But when I got my crown the last time, they had to do a lot more work than they thought they were gonna have to do in terms of drilling and getting it all ready, blah, blah, blah. So I didn't end up teaching that day. I taught that afternoon and my mouth was killing me. It was probably a very bad idea. And I probably ended up doing this to myself. But so I've got subs on backup for today. I just need to um, see how it goes. 
I guess, and go from there. The appointment is at 8 a.m. and it's currently 7.51, so I'm going to be right on time, but I don't want to go. But I will check back in with you. And another thing is, I just don't like being numbed. I don't like that. I mean, I don't know. Uh, I just got up this morning and had my coffee and thought, okay, Tyler, there's nothing you can do about this. You're just going to have to do it. You're going to have to go and you're going to have to put on your big girl panties and deal with it. So that's what I am trying to do. And I know this is very much a first world problem. I will be the first to admit that to everyone, including myself. This is a definite first world problem. But it's still a problem nonetheless. What am I doing here? 700 feet, go on Watauga Street. Perfect. But depending on how I feel, I may go to Ollie's today. I may end up teaching my classes. Who knows? I have to go by the real estate office. I have a closing tomorrow that I have to get ready for. Um, yeah. I'm just very anxious. I'll be better maybe once I get back on the second part of this vlog. <laughs> it's very suspenseful, eh? I've been watching a lot of Canadian um, videos, and so I feel like I'm picking up Canadian accents and Canadian mannerisms. I watch Michelle at Chicken Chickens by the Lake. I watch Nova Scotia Living. I'm very bad at commenting, okay? I'll just tell you. I'm not a very good commenter these days on YouTube, but I do watch you. So if, if uh, Tracy from Nova Scotia Living is watching, or if Michelle from Chickens by the Lake is watching, then hello. I'm totally going in here on the wrong side. This woman's looking at me like, what are you doing? So hello, my little sweet Canadian friends. I feel like I'm picking up y'all's mannerisms. We're here. We're early. I don't even know that they are actually open. Does it even have the hours on there? But anyway, we're five minutes early. I'm gonna head in and I'm just gonna go ahead and get it over with. I'll check back in with you. Hey, I survived. Nom, nom, nom. So they did the x-ray and everything looked fine and they went ahead, they put the crown on. I'm numb. <laughs> they put the crown on with temporary cement and then they are gonna have me come back on December 4th and if it's not bothering me, they are gonna put it on permanently. But they said everything looked good, it should be fine. So that's all I'm gonna say about that because we've talked about the dentist for far too long. Again, I'm sorry that y'all are so shaky. This camera thing that I have is getting worse over time. And I don't know why. I probably need to order a new one. It was like $6 on Amazon. So he gave me another prescription for that um, high potent 800 milligram ibuprofen. And I'm gonna go get that filled. But he said that I could do all my stuff today. So I had gotten subs, but I think I'm gonna teach my classes because I feel fine right now. I'm gonna get that ibuprofen filled and um, get a get one of those in my system. But I mean, I'm still numb, obviously. But hopefully, the crown will be a much better experience than the horrible temporary that they had on there. Anyway, we're done talking about that. I do want to go to Ollie's because it is 9 a.m. and I don't have to be at the Y until 11:30. I also could go to the real estate office if I was really feeling froggy, but. I would almost rather do that when I get done with my second class today. So anyway, I think we're going to go buy all these good stuff cheap and see what we can find. And then later this afternoon, go to the real estate office. I'm sorry this has been so random. I was just very anxious and nerved out this morning and just needed to talk to you all slash get it out of my own head. Sometimes you just need to get it out of your own head. So anyway, I am going to do all those things and we may be back. I may check back in with you. Y'all, that video ended so poorly. I'm so sorry that I was so complainy. I was a nervous wreck that morning. Nene is in a biting mood. She wants to bite me. She went, she doesn't like to be bothered, but yet 
She sits here all the time. Nee, <laughs> nee. And I'm egging her on, so I need to stop it. I'm sorry. So this is where we sit on our heated blanket, don't we? Mm-hmm. She's mad at me. Anyway, I look like death. I just wanted to come on here and update you and let you know that I did get the permanent on with temporary cement. It has not bothered me in the slightest, so I'm hoping everything's good to go. But I just want to apologize for being such a brat in that video and being so complaining about a first world problem. I love you. I mean it. I'll talk to you soon. Goodbye.